Elegoo sent us their latest printer, the Centuri Carbon. Let's unbox it. Now this is the latest printer that they have made and it is a Core XY model. It's also one of Elegoo's fastest printer models. Featuring speeds of 500 millimeters per second velocity and 20,000 millimeters per second squared acceleration. It also prints right out of the box. It features full auto calibration, a chamber camera so you can view it from your phone or PC. It also boasts a build volume of 256 by 256 by 256 millimeters. What's also really exciting for me is this printer is ready to print carbon fiber out of the box. The reason I like this is because it shows me that they're not trying to upsell you on any additional upgrades for the printer. They want you to have the full experience as soon as you buy this thing, which is great for the enthusiast and the beginner. If you're a beginner, there's a lot of room to grow with this machine, and if you're an enthusiast, you know exactly what you're getting when you buy this, no upgrades needed. Now let's talk about the unboxing process. So far, all I've had to do on it was unbox it, take out a few foam pieces, and then there's the standard three screws that hold the bed plate down. You just have to unscrew that. And now we're just plugging in the screen. I believe the entire setup was just the three screws, the screen, the filament roll holder and plugging in the machine. So it's very fast to get ready and printing out of the box. Let me know in the comments if you plan on buying the Century Carbon or if you bought it on pre-order. I'd love to see what the community thinks of the latest Elegoo machine. Here's the printer all unwrapped and unraveled. This thing is very beautiful and we've turned it on. This is what the screen looks like. Now it does not have that glare that is the camera and we're going through the setup process. It's just telling you to take out the screws. And before we can go any further, it does do a device self check. I did not do that because it takes about 30 minutes to go through all of it. But here I am heating up the nozzle to load some filament in there. Elegoo was kind enough to send us a roll of PLA that we're gonna use to print with. Now that the device self check is done, we can go ahead and look at the menus that it offers. It comes with a USB stick, Here's the control schemes to move everything around or calibration. There's uh, many settings in here. I believe you can connect to your Wi-Fi. There's PID tuning, which is awesome. And there's one click self check, which we already went through. And there, I believe there's a few models provided. And of course we are going to do the Benchy that is just standard in the printing industry. Now it is saying that it's gonna print in 15 minutes and 29 seconds. And that would be one of the fastest benchies I have ever printed. If you know of any other benchies that can be printed faster, please leave that in the comment. I would love to know. Maybe I'll try to get this down to 12 minutes. If you guys do want to support me, there is a link below in the description to my Patreon. I have some files made on there that you guys can download and access. It's just a way for me to do continue making printer review videos and continue making reels and shorts for you guys. What's that? 15 minutes are already done and the bench is complete? Yes. Look at that. It turned out great. Let's take a closer look at it though and do some finer inspection. To me, this is an acceptable print. I am not OCD nor am I crazy. So I think this is very acceptable for a 15 minute print that is beyond fast. Only thing I can see is that little band in the middle there, but overall my eye can't spot any defects on this Benchy. Now let's go look at the inside of the machine. There is a chute in the back where filament discharges and it gets pooped out the back, which is something that I'm not too fond of, but I'm sure people will create cool files to fix this issue. Remember, if you did watch this video, check out the links below. There will be a link to this and my Patreon. 